do like and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to never miss any update. In this video, I'll show you how to draw irregular plot in AutoCAD. So this is a very important topic. So let's start. So whenever you are going to draw a building drawing or floor plan, then you need to draw the plot area first. So to construct a building, we need a plot first. So what is plot area? Plot area is the area of the plot on which we intend to construct a building. Okay. Now if your plot is in rectangular shape or square shape, then you can draw it easily. But if your plot is in irregular shape, then how can you draw this? So this is our today's topic. How to draw irregular plot in AutoCAD. Okay. So it's a very important topic. So this is also commonly asked in AutoCAD interviews. Now if you are preparing for AutoCAD interviews, then it's very important for you also. You need to practice this because this is a very common question and you may face this situation during any structural drawing. Okay. So let's see how to draw this irregular set plot. So first, I'll draw this irregular shaped plot. Okay. So this is four sides irregular shaped plot. So here all side dimensions are given. Here all side dimensions are not same and we don't know angles also. So here this is 45 feet, this is 40 feet, this is 30 feet and this is 35 feet and this is 55 feet. Okay. So here I'll take this 45 plank line, I'll take this line as baseline. Okay. So first take line command. I'll enter. Now specify first point here. Now specify the length as 45 feet. And press enter. So this is our baseline. Okay. This is the 45 feet line is the baseline. Okay. So next I'll create this line. This is 40 feet line. But we cannot draw this line with line command because we don't know this angle. Okay. So for that we need to draw a circle with 40 feet radius here. And we need to draw another circle with 55 feet radius here. Okay. So this is 40 feet. This is 55 feet. So after drawing this, these two circles we will get this intersection point of these two circles. Okay. So take this is the these two points should be the center point of the circle. So take circle now specify center point here click here and specify the radius as 40 feet and press enter. Again take circle now specify center point here click here and specify the radius as 55 feet and press enter. Now see this is the intersection point of these two circles. So, join this point with this point and this point with this point. So, take line command, I'll enter. Now, click here. This is the first point. Now, make ortho off. Now, join this here. Now, delete these two circles. Now, join this point with this point. So, take line command. Now, click here and click here. Now, see, this is created. Now, I'll check the measurements. Go to aligned. Now, see, this is 45 feet. This is 40 feet and this is 55 feet. Okay. So next I'll create this line 30 feet and this line 35 feet. So for that we need to draw a circle with 30 feet radius on this point and we need to draw another circle with 35 feet radius on this point. Okay. So take circle now specify center point here and Specify the radius as 30 feet. Now press enter. Now again take circle. Now specify the center point here. Now specify the radius as 35 feet. And press enter. So this is the intersection point of these two circle. So join this point with this point and this point with this point. So take line command L enter. Click here first point and click here. This is the second point. Now delete these two circles. Now join these two points. Click here and click here. Now see. Check the measurements. This is 30 feet. And this is 35 feet. So see 
this irregular site irregular uh, set plot is created this is 30 feet this is 35 feet this is and this is 55 feet okay so this is now if you want to check this then select copy this is the base point just keep it here don't click see this is same plot okay so like this you can create any irregular set plot okay so next I'll create this triangular set plot so this is 50 feet this is 46 feet this is 35 feet so here I'll take this 50 feet line as baseline so for that take line command I'll enter now specify first point here make ortho on now specify the length as 50 feet and press enter so this is the baseline next I'll create this line and this line is 46 this is 35 so for that we need to draw a circle with 46 feet radius on this point and we need to draw another circle with 35 feet radius on this point okay so take circle command and the intersection point will be this okay so take circle and specify center point here now specify the radius as 46 feet and press enter so this this circle is created now take again circle specify the center point here now specify the radius as 35 feet and press enter now see this is the intersection point of these two circles now join this point with this point and this point with this point so take line command l enter click here make ortho off and click here this is the second point now delete these two circles now join these two points click here and click here so see this triangular set plot is created now check the measurements aligned so this is 50 feet this is 46 feet and this is 35 feet now if you want to check this whether this is correct or not then just select copy and this is the base point you can take any point as base point and just keep it okay see this is same next i'll create this plot this is 50 this is 55 feet this 64 feet this is 62 feet and this is 43 feet okay so i'll take this line as baseline so for that take line command i'll enter now specify first point here make ortho on now specify the length as 55 feet and press enter so this is our baseline next i'll create this line this is 64 feet so for that we need to draw a circle with 64 feet radius on this side and again we need to draw a circle with same 64 feet radius on this side because we are here only this line 64 feet line okay so take circle specify center point here click here and specify the radius as 64 feet and press enter again take circle now specify center point here and specify the radius as 64 feet same 64 feet and press enter so this is the intersection intersection point now join this point with this point so line click here make got the off and click here so this is the 64 feet line is created okay so next i'll create this line and and this line this is 64 2 feet and this is 43 feet so for that we need to draw a circle with 62 feet radius here and another circle we need to create with 43 feet radius here so take circle specify center point here specify the radius as 62 feet and press enter again take circle and specify center point here on this point and specify the radius as 43 feet this is yeah 43 feet and press enter so this is the intersection point of these two circles so join this point with this point and this point with this point so take line command l enter click here this is the first point click here the second point now delete these two circles now join these two points click here and join this here okay now see this is 55 feet this is 64 feet this is 62 feet and this is 43 feet now see this plot is created okay this is 62 feet and this is 43 feet okay 
now if you want to check this then copy and see this is same plot okay so next i'll create this plot so here this is 45 feet this is 30 feet this 68 feet this is 53 feet and this is 54 feet here all dimensions are different so i'll take this line as baseline so take line command i'll enter now specify first point here make ortho on now specify the length as 45 feet and press enter so this is our baseline next i'll create this line okay so we cannot draw this line with line command i have already told this because we don't know this angle so for that we need to create a circle with 30 feet radius here and we need to create another circle with 54 feet radius here okay to get the intersection point okay so this will be the intersection point okay so take circle command now specify center point here this is the center point now specify the radius as 30 feet press enter again take circle command specify center point here and specify the radius as 54 feet now press enter so this is the intersection point of these two circles now join this point with this point and this point with this point okay take line command now join this make auto off click here again delete these two circles now join this point with this point now see this is done now i check the measurements aligned so this is see this is 45 feet this is 30 feet and this is 54 feet okay so next i'll create this line 68 feet and this line 53 feet so for that we need to create a circle with 68 feet radius on this point and we need to create another circle with 53 feet radius on another point so this is the center point specify the radius as uh, 68 feet and press enter take another circle and specify the center point here click here and specify the radius as 53 feet and press enter so see this is the intersection point of these two circles now join this point with this point and this point with this point so take line command l enter click here first point and click here at second point now delete these two circles now join these two points click here and click here now see this irregular plot is also created so check the dimensions this is 68 feet this is 53 feet okay this is 45 this is 45 this is 30 this is 30 feet this is 68 this is 68 feet this is 53 feet this is 53 feet and this is 54 feet okay so hope you understand what we did here here we created a circle with 40 feet radius on this point and this is 40 feet and I have drawn a 55 feet radius circle on this point okay to get the intersection point okay but here as this is a 64 feet line this is a single line so we created a 64 feet radius circle on this point and another point okay this is the and here if i want to check the whether this is correct or not see this is correct this is the same plot okay so here I have created a circle with 40 feet radius and 55 feet radius okay to get the intersection point this is 40 feet radius circle and here I created 55 feet radius circle to get this point okay but here I created 46 feet radius circle and 35 feet radius this in this point I created 46 feet radius circle and in this point I created 35 feet radius circle to get this point okay but here i created 64 feet radius circle on this point and again i created 64 feet radius circle on this point to get 
this point because we have only single line single 64 feet radio, uh, line here okay and here we have created 54 feet radius and 30 feet radius in this side we have created 30 feet radius circle and this side we have created 54 feet radius circle to get this intersection point okay so like this you can create any irregular shaped plot okay so this is very easy so hope you like this video now if you like this video then don't forget to like and subscribe the channel thank you for watching